Hey guys, Holiday Master here. Today I got a pretty cool video for you. Today's video is of a six foot animated uh, leprechaun popping out of a pot of gold. Um, I've never seen this one. There are a few on Amazon, like the newer four footer ones that are off brand that I've seen. Um, this one is an off brand too. I'm not sure what company. These are the instructions that came with it, but no company name. Uh, came in a plain brown box. Found this on Facebook actually. So huge shout out to the lady that was really nice with me and uh, you know was very understanding, very polite, and sold me this item. <clears throat> so I don't have a box to review, but there's the instructions. Here's the item. Um, again, I've never seen this one, and. I was talking to the lady, and she said she got it at some store in New York, which kind of took me by surprise, but I believe it. Um, it had two cheap fans, and it only had LEDs in the Leprechaun. They were burnt out. But what's really weird is the fans were not on the back of this thing. They're actually on the sides. That one was the thing that inflated the whole thing. And then you go to the other side. And that one was the animation fan. I've never seen a, a pop-up with the fans, you know, not in the back, but one on each side. That, to me, was a little bizarre. And then the stake holders are on top. So you'd be staking it down like that, rather than them being on the bottom. Which, again, to me is weird, but... Maybe it happens more on off-brands than I realize. Um, the other thing it had was it had four tubes. It had two in the front, which is right here, and two in the back. And pretty much how this worked was those four tubes, again, two in the front, two in the back, were connected to the pot of gold that inflated the leprechaun. That bottom half was actually tied off and it so that little fan only inflated like a two foot section that was the animation <laughs> however i did what i do best and i swapped it over to a base fan it just inflates better and the the animation works a whole lot better um <clears throat> so yeah um now the only thing with this i did not put c7s in it um, I'm really debating on if I want to do that or not. I, I like it how it is. Um, it, it would just be really difficult to string lights in this thing just because of how the pot is set up. Uh, I could put them in the leprechaun, but then you won't see the happy St. Patrick's. So I think when I use it this year, I'm just going to put a spotlight on it and call it good. And then maybe next year I, I might put lights in it just to see what it looks like. I'm not sure yet. But, uh, yeah, so without further ado, here we go. Now what I did was there's a, a base fan in the back of it. And I cut a little hole just so it would stay. See, and it's six foot, but this thing's like five foot wide. It's, it's enormous. That's why I felt like it was better with a... Um, there it is. There's the other two tubes. I felt it was better with a base fan. Let's see if it's going to make a fool of me. But, yeah... Again, it, it's just, I feel like it would be too tricky to pull lights, you know, all through there. But it inflates really good. Here, I want to try something. There it goes. I don't know why it does that. Sometimes it, sometimes that timer goofs up, but like once it's, 
once it goes, it goes. And the coin, it has coins hanging from his hand. They're actually like a thick fabric. And that's how well it inflates. It actually moves the whole pot. Yeah, it's about six and a half feet. Like I said, the pot is huge though. Um, and again, I might add some lights in it. I, I really think this one gives me a classic vibe. Even though it's newer, it gives me a classic vibe. Um, I might add lights in the leprechaun just to have lights in them. The string holders, you can see there are on the sides. There's two on each side. Um, I'm thinking about using this guy on the porch this year. Uh, my buddy Cody let me borrow his St. Patrick's stuff uh, just because he's not doing one this year. He's doing Valentine's and Easter. So whenever I get that up within the next few weeks, I'll do a video of it and give him a huge shout out. And uh, yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.